Good morning, Doctor. Good morning, class. Please sit down. Today, we will start with a new chapter: subtraction of two and three-digit numbers. Do you know what subtraction means? Yes, Max. Tell us. Sir. To subtract means to take away. That is correct, Max. And we always take away the smaller number from the larger number. The answer we get is called the difference. We use minus sign. It is called. The minus sign. Let me take an example. There are six chalks in the chalk box. If I take away two chalks, then how many chalks are left in the box? Yes, Amber. Sir, there would be four chalks left in the box. Very good, Amber. Six minus two equals four. Let's write it. Very well done, class. There is one more thing that you should remember. When zero is subtracted from any number. The number does not change. For example, six minus zero is six. I am minus. Do you know how to subtract two-digit numbers? Well, let me show you how. Let us subtract thirty-two from eighty-nine. First, write the two numbers on top of each other. Always remember to put the larger number on the top. Subtract the ones place first. Nine minus two is seven. Now let us subtract the numbers at the tens place. Eight minus three is five. So the answer is fifty-seven. There you go. Catch you soon. Bye. Well, let me teach you another topic. Regrouping numbers. Regrouping numbers makes subtraction easier. All of you, please come here to my table. There are forty-five candies in this jar. Let me take them out. Let's divide them into two parts. One part with five candies, and the other part with forty candies. Now, we know forty equals thirty plus ten. So, now we divide forty into two parts of ten and thirty. Now we can join these two groups. So we have grouped forty-five into thirty plus fifteen. Hmm. Let us go through the whole thing again. Well, children, this is how. We do regrouping. So, have you all understood the method? 
Yes, Dr. Owl. Hmm, very good. Duckly, can you come try regrouping 76 on the board? Yes, sir. That's wonderful, Duckly. Hello, kids. Hope you enjoyed the lesson. Let us recall some important points. To subtract means to take away. We always take away the smaller number from the larger number. The sign we use to show subtraction is minus sign. It is written as the answer we get is called the difference. When zero is subtracted from any number, the number does not change. Regrouping numbers. Numbers can be regrouped to make subtraction easier. <laughs>